Bom dia! Good afternoon, good evening, wherever you are on this beautiful world, whenever you're watching this video, welcome to the Bitcoin Family YouTube channel. And of course, first things first, guys, so happy, happy new all time all high! 23,777 US dollar per Bitcoin, new all time high. Congratulations to all the hodlers, to all the Bitcoin people, to my daughter, because she hodls Bitcoin as well, and to all the other people in this world that hold Bitcoin. In today's short video, because I have a shitload of interviews today, they always call when Bitcoin makes a new all-time high, only talking about Bitcoin, 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 and, and Bitcoin, and a little bit more Bitcoin, so not any other news, a little bit about the family, and a little bit about the Bam Bam indicator, but mostly today a short cool video about some really cool Bitcoin charts because you all want to know where are we going next with Bitcoin. I am going to show you in this video. Bam! First things first guys, let's start with the TA part, the part where I bomb you with really cool Bitcoin charts. This part. BAM! If you look at this chart guys, you can see that we had a 2400 US dollar candle yesterday. The low was 19,130 and the high was 21,570 US dollar. So that's a difference of 2400 US dollar. And today guys, Today we are forming a 4,000 US dollar candle because we opened at 19,700 US dollar and we went all the way up to 23,777 US dollar. That's a 4,000 US dollar candle. What kind of candle will be next? 6K? 10K? What do you think? I don't know. I don't know. I don't know. Okay, let's try it again. So the first yesterday was 2,400 US dollar candle. Yeah. Today we had a 4,000 US dollar candle. So more tomorrow we maybe will have a 6,000 6, US dollar candle. You know, no, that's just guessing out there. And that's just all the happiness of this new all time high. <laughs> yes, I was smiling this morning when I got up. I saw Bitcoin 20K, 22K, 23K. You know, it's just so strange. And it's also satisfying the feeling because you have been shouting this for many, many months and many years to many people. I convinced so many people to buy Bitcoin below 10,000 US dollar. For the ones that didn't buy it, don't freak out, only zoom out. But I warned you and I told you. So don't come to me now and ask me, Didi, should I buy Bitcoin now? No, I wouldn't buy Bitcoin at the moment. I would wait for a small dip to buy a little bit of Bitcoin. You should have bought when I told you they should have. Yeah, they should. They should have. You heard? She, she's always right. She and my wife and my other two daughters, they are always right. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, you see? They are never wrong. Never. On the next chart, guys, I show you what could be next. So let's take a look at this chart. Bam! On this chart, you can see that if we continue this trend, we can take it all the way up to 24,000 US dollar. But on the other hand, if we don't continue the trend, so we need to tap these lines twice or break one of these upper lines, resistance lines. And if you are not able to do that, then we can fall back down to the zero level of the Fibonacci retracement, which is around 20,900 US dollar. So we have this whole opportunity. We can drop to 20,900, but we can also go bam to 24,100 US dollar if we reach the level one of Fibonacci in this graph really cool um, yes and of course volatile as hell at the moment i don't know what is going to happen but you know i just don't freak out i try to zoom out and just look at it as a beautiful musical play or something like this because in my opinion we are just getting started this will just be the first orange dot on the stock to flow chart so we are just on track to the 100k we all want to see next year with christmas next year with christmas jingle bell jingle bell all the way Bitcoin is here to stay. You cannot rhyme. You're, no. not, you're not a good rhymer. Eh? No, I, Rapper? No. Singer? No. Dancer? No, yeah. Yeah, <laughs> she's a very good dancer. But she doesn't want to share. She doesn't want to show you that how good she is. How do you? No. I On the beach? No. No? no. Also, guys, the DD Bam Bam indicator did really well with the indicator. Let's take a look at this chart. You can see how we traded yesterday and how much profit we made because of the DD Bam Bam indicator. 
Check this chart. Bam! <laughs> I thought maybe she would do it, but we do it together. Just the two of us. We traded on a 15 minute chart with Bybit with a leverage of 15. Yes, you're not used for me to take these kind of risks, but yesterday I felt really bullish. So I thought, let's try it with a leverage of 15. And we played with 250 US dollar. The first trade was at 9 a.m. It was a long, it was a long with more than 100% profit guys. So that turned the 250 US dollar in 520 US dollar. Then guys, at 7 p.m. We did another long, so we took that 520 US dollar and because of setting a trailing stop loss last night when we go to bed, we were kicked out of the trade this morning at 6 a.m. and we had a profit of more, of more than 100% and we ended up with 1100 US dollar. So we turned 250 US dollar into 1100 US dollar just by doing two trades indicated by the Didi Bam Bam indicator. That's a shitload of profit. Yeah. That's four times. Mm. That's cool. We, today we go for dinner and, and we buy ice cream and, and we buy you a new iPhone. No, 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 no. Yeah, <laughs> she wants a new iPhone. I want a new iPhone as well. You know, but we live pretty minimalistic. We try to, you know, spend money to the things that really matter to life. And yes, now and then we deserve a new iPhone. Yeah. But she needs to make more videos with me. Comment down below if you want to see D Jolie more often in the videos because she just does it once a week. Comment down below if you want to see Jolie more often in the videos. Let's talk some more Bitcoin. Let's take a look at this chart. Bam! On this chart, you can see the Puel multiple. And you can see how the Puel multiple was reaching highs at the 2012-13 run, at the, at the 2014 run, at the 2015-17 run, at the 2018 high, at the 2019 high. You can see that the Powell multiple, this line, this bottom line, was hugely peaking. Now look at the Powell multiple at the moment. We are still down on the charts. We can go up tremendously. We have a lot of upwards movement possibilities. So don't think that this is the end of this bull run. We are just getting started, like you can see in this Puel multiple chart. Really cool to see now and then what it is. If you don't know what the Puel multiple is, it has to do with the miners and if miners are willing to sell all their Bitcoins. So Google it. Google is the best educator out there or YouTube it and you will learn more about the Puel multiple. I already made some videos about it. So if you want to know more, check the channel and check for the uh, search for the word Puel multiple and you will understand exactly what it is. But the most important thing to see is that we have a lot of upwards movement possibilities. We are still just starting this bull run. Then we have one more boring chart for Julie because she really doesn't like to talk about charts. But you know, today is a Bitcoin chart day. We will talk about some more when we walk back. This chart is a four year cycle chart. Really cool chart. Check this chart. Bam! On this chart, you can see the four year cycles of every halving. You can see the 2012 halving cycle, you can see the 2016 halving cycle, and you can now see the 2020 halving cycle. Just check them. Just pause the video and look at this chart and try to comment down below what you see. The thing that I see is that we are just getting started, guys. We are now exactly copying the previous cycles, and this would mean we would end up at the top of the square on the top of the chart, which is around 100,000 US dollar. And we can peak even higher with a wick, maybe even to 200,000 US dollar. Who knows? But if we would repeat this four year cycle that we have been making in the previous bull runs, we will see a 100,000 US dollar price next year. Only positive news today about Bitcoin. And yes, when Bitcoin crashes, only negative news about Bitcoin as well. We try to keep it transparent. But I've been telling you for months now, guys, that I was expecting Bitcoin to explode and it just did explode. It had a 4K candle and this is just the beginning, guys. So enjoy this beautiful roller coaster ride called the Bitcoin Family Life. Bam! And we switched sides because, you know, Jolie needs to talk as well. What do you think about our new Bitcoin Family song? It's cool. I, the one from the girl, right? Yeah, the one from the girl. Oh, oh. Don't, don't tell that we have another one. Oops. There's another one in the make, but yeah, it'll take some time. But that one? Um, from the girl, it's really Lore, cool. Lore, Lore Olivas. Yeah. yeah. It's amazing that she did that. Yeah, it's so nice. Yeah. You know, I, I, she just asked me, do you have a lyric? And I said, yeah, I, I wrote something while walking. And I sent her the lyrics, a little bit of shame. I was like, like beginner songwriter lyrics, lyrics that I wrote. 
Yeah, I hold all my bitcoins here, I hold all my bitcoins there, I hold all my bitcoins fucking everywhere. This. So I, I song is a little bit like how I think it should say, uh, sound. So I was like, oh, she's going to laugh at me. And then she just responded like a few hours later with like the first preview of the track. And the moment I heard her voice, I got goosebumps and I was like, wow, this is going to be really cool. And then she started to make the track more beautiful and beautiful. And now the end result is just, yeah. it's just, can you sing it? No. <laughs> Why not? You're a good singer. No, I'm not. You are? No. That metal. Bitcoin. Like this? No. 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 But the song was really cool. She even included the bam, bam part. Bam, bam. You know, all that stuff. And, and we, we, we put some videos of the family below it. Just how the trip has been for us the last couple of years. Um, Jolie, if I ask you, yeah. the last four years of our lives, mm -hmm. what is your opinion? Um, my opinion? Well, I'm grateful, for sure, because what? it's been four crazy and happy, but also a little bit of negativity sometimes. Years, it was like a roller coaster. Yeah, that's it was my opinion. It's ups a roller and downs. coaster. Yeah, yeah. yeah. It definitely is. It definitely was. Yeah. But so, if you just look back in those four years, what what is for you the most beautiful moment, or what what are the most beautiful moments? What did you, if you think back, think back of these four years? What is the thing that comes to your mind first? I think for sure helping all the charities and donating. Okay. And the diving always keeps coming back. Yeah, it's in cool. Bali. Huh? In Bali. Yeah. If I ask Juna, she always says uh, Australia. Yeah. And Jess also, she loves the animals over there. So, and if you need to be honest, what is the most negative part of the trip? Well, I'm 15 and... Are you 15 already? <laughs> Serious? Yeah. Fuck. She's already 15. Time so flies. Privacy is sometimes needed and I sometimes don't get that. When you're like, especially when we traveled in the camp van and the van. Oh, yeah. It was like 24 <laughs> 7 together and it was like getting crazy a little bit. Yeah. But yeah. Yeah, I can understand it because if you're 15, you need you need privacy. Huh? Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> but no, that's that's the that, that's the hardest part. You know, you, you are 24 7 together and they don't always like me. That's no. like definitely true. You know, I'm not always the perfect dad. I, I am, but they don't see it like that. That's the difference. No. <laughs> But it's a, it's a, we just have a family life, ups and downs, just like a normal family, um, only we travel. If you could choose now, would you want to live in a house and stay there the rest of our lives? Or would you want to continue this lifestyle and just slow travel, like stay for a couple of months in a country? I think I like the slow traveling a lot now, because we've been through the fast traveling and our traveling is good. And then after that, maybe settling down in a house. So we will slow travel for six more years or something. Six? <laughs> yeah, I don't know. No. Like two more years. Then Th I'll be traveling alone. W when do you want to start traveling alone? Maybe when I'm 18. 18? Yeah. I think that's a very good age. But maybe, you know, if Bitcoin goes up more and more and more, yeah. maybe I can spend a little bit extra next time when you're 16. I rent you a beautiful house in a party town in Ibiza or somewhere. And then you can invite your girlfriends there and have this, yeah. What sweet 16 pool party yeah. stuff. Maybe and, something like this. And boyfriends. <laughs> boy, 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 boyfriends? Yeah, boyfriends. You know, I told you many times, if your boyfriend doesn't have bitcoins, I will kick his ass. I will kick him out of the door. So no. for the guys, I know she's really nice. She can be a bitch as well. She is beautiful, but she will only accept you if you have all bitcoins. No bitcoins, go. If you come with this orange card, like a bank card from the ING Bank in the Netherlands, go. Hollow bitcoins, but don't touch it. Don't touch it. No, what's not don't touch it? No. Can't touch it. Yeah. What is the song again? I don't know, it's like... Hammer time. Can't touch it. It's not can't touch it. What the? It is can't touch it. MC Hammer. I can't touch it. <laughs> I don't know. I, I completely forgot. It was one of my favorite dance. Is there anything else you want to tell the people? Mm, not really. I want to tell you a little bit more. I, If I were you guys, I would make sure you watch tomorrow's video 
at Gokstein Media because we did something really cool yesterday and Jolly liked it as well yeah. maybe a little bit too long but it was really nice and it will be in the video tomorrow so make sure you watch that video also make sure guys that you sign up to the discord server and become part of this huge kick-ass bitcoin family that we are forming over there already more than thousand members talking about bitcoin blockchain and life every day sharing each other's knowledge and yes also incentivizing each other with family tokens for the help that we give each other it's a really cool community that wants to try to change the world using the tools bitcoin and blockchain so you're invited to come and visit us over there and then you will be updated also a day earlier on these beautiful songs that we will post maybe there will be another song that we will post soon but you will see these things these things first on the discord server and then a day or two days later on the rest of the social media so make sure you become part of the family maybe even buy some family tokens because when you hold those family tokens you get some extra privileges in the discord server really cool to be there so come on join us should they yeah you should they you should you say you should so that was everything for today guys if you enjoyed the video please give the video a thumbs, thumbs up. up share it with your friends and family subscribe to the channel hit the notification bell and please leave a comment as Jolie loves to respond to your comments she will help me again with responding to your comments today she doesn't do it every day she should do it every day I hope you enjoyed the video um, always remember guys to zoom out in Bitcoin and, and to, to zoom in on life try to enjoy life every single minute of the day as that is exactly what life should be about thanks for watching and hopefully see you tomorrow again Bye. BAM